This goes in pain. He's hurt. The tournament is on the line for Mark Briscoe as Swerve Strickland looks to pick up his nine points in the Continental Classic, a back and forth battle. But Taz, it has been all Swerve Strickland for the last few moments. Yes, yeah, Swerve has brought a heavy offense on the body of Mark Briscoe. And he loves it. He's cocky right now. And I don't blame Strickland, Siobhan. He should be confident right now. Absolutely. See, with six points already under his belt, absolutely. He should be ve feeling very good about this tournament and himself. And Swerve, as we saw throughout picture and picture, concentrating a lot of his offense on the back, the spine of Briscoe, and now perhaps going to go after the arms. But not just the arms, Taz. This affects the entire upper body. It does. He's got the arm trapped, the other arm trapped with a hammer lock. And now you got to watch his kind of pop that shoulder or his elbow, but Briscoe scouted him. Yeah, nice up kick there by Briscoe to escape. And Tony, here comes it. Red Nick Kung Fu. That was awesome. That was awesome. Briscoe turns around, pops the hips, lays in the chop to Swerve Strickland. Swerve breaks the grip, but Briscoe firing back with those chops. Those are heavy chops. We've discussed it. You don't have to be 6'5", 290 to throw a hard chop. It's about hand speed and hips. Briscoe on target with the elbow strike. Swerve reeling a bit here. As Briscoe closes that distance. The high boot in the corner. This could be his moment right here, guys. Mark Briscoe. Fisherman oh. Buster. Might be it. Yes, sir. The cover and the hook and Swerve able to kick out. Strong legs for Swerve, kicked out of that. Yeah, Briscoe's a little, little bit frustrated. I don't blame him. He thought he had it, but the referee did the right thing. Strickland kicked out before the three. And fans around the world will be joining us in London August 25th, 2024. Will you be there? You have the chance right now. LiveNation.co.uk, Ticketmaster.co.uk. We will see you for all in London next August. And for a half, we've got a half and half here. Peeled it off, did Briscoe. Peeled off the hand of Strickland, which is the right way to combat a half Nelson. This event in Wembley, nine months away, we've already sold over 3,000 pounds, over four or four, three million dollars. Oh, Swerve Strickland. Four million dollars. Tickets still on sale. Turns the corner, the German suplex. And now Swerve rolls through. Leaps up. Oh, the roundhouse kick connects. Swerve, is he going to take it here? Two. Yeah. Let's go. Holy smoke. Super close. Strickland can't believe that Briscoe kicked out. This is a great, great tournament match. And I mean, so much is riding on the line for both men. Oh, and look, oh. at, look at Mark Briscoe just oh. trying to pump himself up here. You're right, Shivani. But thus far, this continent of classic blue and gold leagues have been awesome. And you're, I love it. Yeah, we've seen, we saw some incredible matches on collision. Brody King out to a six point lead. Wins over Eddie Kingston and Claudio Castagnoli. Two tournament favorites. Claudio, he was my pick to take it all, but. Now back on Wednesday, Gold League action, Mark Briscoe trying to keep his hopes alive, but Swerve trying to prevent the superplex. Yeah, good countering right there. Counter, I should say, by Strickland. Oh. Slap to the side of wow. the face, that overhand. Just knocked him right away. Mark Briscoe, I think, maybe lured him into a oh. 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 Digging <laughs> uppercut there from Mark Briscoe. And now Briscoe over the top, just throwing his body at Swerve. Briscoe, man, he's leaving it all out here. He's like, hey, man, you know what? The pressure's on me. I've got zero points. I don't give a damn. I'm going for the gusto, and he's doing that. Mark Briscoe. Comes no. in. Lariat. Briscoe on target. The near leg. Hooked. And no. Swerve able to kick out. Tough to kick out of a close line like that, but desperate times, desperate measures, and that's what Briscoe did here. Look at that shot. Uh, he's got to dig deep now. He was shocked about that non-1-2-3, but he's got to dig deep and go back to the attack again, and that's what he's doing. I think the key for Mark Briscoe, oh, wait a second, he's looking for Jay Driller here. A double underhook pile driver. Made famous by his late brother. How sweet would it be to pick up his first three points in the tournament? He's got it. He's got it. Jay Driller knows. Swerve had it scouted, but Jay 
Briscoe goes through. House pull on target. Counted out of that roll up from a sunset flip right into that kick. You see Swerve still a little unsteady, but he finds his footing on the top. 450 splash. Oh, he's up. rushed. That's incredible. Two. He's got him. He had the knees up, and I thought he had it one, Excalibur. Razor thin margin on that, but Swerve still alive in this match. But Mark Briscoe still alive in this tournament. Could be the Froggy Bow. Froggy Bow, no! The knees got out. The knees right that time. The roll up, and Briscoe kicks out. What a battle these two wow. guys are having here. Fans loving it, just cheering here in Montreal. Look at them. A great pro wrestling match in a great pro wrestling city of Montreal. One of the best in the world, actually. Great fans here, and they're loving it. 15 Ten. minutes gone by, five remain. I was, right. I was actually just about to say, I don't have my stopwatch handy, but the clock felt like it was becoming an issue. Justin Roberts just confirmed it. Five minutes left. As Mark Briscoe, the double underhook, could it be the J-Driller on the apron? As Swerve breaks free. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Be careful. Got it. Down. Valley Driver. You saw Briscoe try to grab onto the ropes in vain. The Death Valley Driver. And now Swerve to the top. Swerve. Stop. Is this going to be it? It is. The winner of this match. Swerve. The key, to, the key to that one, Taz, was after the Death Valley driver for Swerve to get in the ring quickly. Well, exactly. Sense of urgency. And that's exactly what Strickland showed. He knew he had Briscoe down and out hurting. And we see Strickland holding up those nine fingers for nine points. Nine points for Sir Strickland. He draws level with John Moxley wow. once again. Nine crucial points for Swerve. Unfortunately for Mark Briscoe, his third loss means that he is mathematically eliminated from winning the Continental Classic. However, he will still compete. He will still look to make the best showing possible. Yeah, I think Briscoe deserves a lot of credit. He put his body out here and worked hard, but not able to get the victory. Swerve got it.